Hi everybody, welcome to another video on the channel. Uh, in today's little snippet, what I want to show you is a little project that one of my students put together uh, at our field day, which is a great day for middle school and primary school kids at our school. Um, we, we wanted to build something kind of cool. We wanted to build like a fairground attraction. And so uh, what we did was uh, we got a Concept 2 rowing machine uh, and um, we basically got an Arduino board and a Bluetooth chip and put that on there. And then we started to work on how to get the Arduino board to talk to the PM5 monitor uh, on, the, on, the, on the rowing machine. And so ultimately what we came up with was this setup here with this laptop running the Arduino uh, sketch app and then uh, the, the, the Arduino board with a Bluetooth. What we did was we tried to figure out how we could get the watts uh, onto the Arduino board so the Arduino board could control the number of LED lights that would lit up um, on this LED strip, right? So we wanted to see, you know, if you're pulling harder on the machine, whether or not we could get more lights to show up. So kind of like, you know, with the hammer at the fairground with the, you know, with the thing that hits the bell, the kind of the rowing version of that. And so here's us kind of trying to test it out, and I'm and I'm on the rowing machine there, and um, we're we're basically and and we're basically rowing hard, and the lights are coming on, and we finally got this thing to work, um, which was really really cool, and the kids had a great time with it, and uh, you know it was a real blast to try to do something a little bit out of the box, uh, and full credit to the student for putting this together because they kind of figured out how to do it, but there's the light strip. Um, you could light the whole thing up at like 300 watts and uh, it was really pretty cool uh, and there's a little video here of it working here. So thanks for tuning in. Uh, we will put the information about the parts on the blog and uh, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.